Good morning. We're in Los Cristianos. It's Wednesday the 6th of March. Let's move off there. It's been cloudy all morning, still warm at uh, 25 degrees. It's just gone 10 o'clock. Plenty of people walking around. Um, I've noticed this morning that there's not that many British, whether they just can't be bothered to get out of bed, I don't know. But uh, yeah, we're in Los Cristianos. Uh, for those who subscribe to me, uh, this is what my channel first started out as, um, Neil Davis in Tenerife. So I'm just going to pan around to the beach, people are playing, playing volleyball. Um, so a lot of people who have subscribed to me are probably here from my prostate videos. But uh, we do come to Tenerife maybe a couple of times a year. And uh, this is what we enjoy doing, just walking around, showing people the sights of Tenerife. Uh, as I say, it's been cloudy all morning, but it looks like it probably will break out this afternoon. Still lots of people about, say so it's March. As you see, it's probably a, an older, older people rather than the young crew here. Um, the people are just walking around, exercising. We like Christianos, it's a local, not in your face place. Still has a fire. Many bars, many lively bars uh, in the even time. Nice restaurants. It's a famous Burger King there in Cristianos. So the sun do keep coming out now and then. There's a few people on the beach, but uh, I think people just enjoying the exercise and then probably settle down this afternoon once the suns get to work and uh, the clouds burn off so there's the viking ship here a few people on the beach not a breath of wind today which is unusual for tenerife i'm just going to walk more into the Los Cristianos here. Big hotel, if you can see it in the distance. Gran Arona, the best hotel here. Uh, Cristianos. They don't have many, many, many big hotels. It's more apartments, more people, second homes. There are a few down here, probably six or seven. I'm um, staying in the Paradise Park, which is just up a hill. It's about 15 minutes walk from where we are now. Um, we call it Cardiac Hill. It's right. There is a bus, a shuttle bus, if you need it. But uh, exercise is good. You see, there's plenty of people. Many people about. A few locals have a little bit of an argument here. We normally come here in February, March time. Uh, October, me and my partner and her daughter would go to Las Americas, normally the best Tenerife. Uh, beaches are nicer down the side here, down the bottom here, sorry. Um, just going to pan around again to the sea. A few things here, slides. Water is a lot calmer here. 
uh, along the side of Las Americas, you get more the surface. Um, it's more choppy down there, but uh, no, it's lovely. So it's 25. And that probably is 25 because there's no a breath of wind, to be honest. I suppose with a lack of wind, it's not moving the cloud far. But uh, it's haze, sunshine. 25. No problem there. People's just wondering what to do, I suppose. Late breakfast. And with the movement, I came out this morning about nine o'clock. There's hardly anybody about. A few joggers. But uh, a few people having breakfast. All the typical shops on the left hand side selling everything you want sandals, shirts, hats, sun creams. For me, Los Cristianos is probably the best place out of Las Americas and the Deki. Again, it's, the beaches are better, less in your face, so very much more local. Lots of people have second homes in the apartments in and around here. Um, yeah. Certainly busy as well. There's a lot of people who do come down here. Here, braid and girls. No hair to braid, sorry, girls. Sellers is normally pump the music out lunchtime. Not quite lunchtime yet, half past ten. People are having a cheeky beer just for lunch. Let's get your lucky lucky men some. The glasses, and whatever you want to buy from them. I'm just trying this mic out again. I got this road mic, so just just trying it out. See how it goes. We'll just video this, play it back. The sound's okay. Job's good. I'm hoping with this mic that you don't get the wind. But today is no wind, so I'm not really going to be able to test it out. So we're just walking through Cristianos towards the Gran Arona, Sol Arona, whatever the hotel's called. Just going to keep on here for another five minutes till we get to the Moccolino restaurant. And uh, that'll do for a little while. So yeah, um, so a lot of people do subscribe through my prostate. Uh, where we are at the minute is uh, I've got an appointment when I go back to UK next week to see oncology. I've reached the 0.2 and I've been referred. It's probably just to sit down and chat with them what's going to happen, what's coming up, what the options. So I'm just glad that uh, we've been able to get that appointment with them rather than sitting with the urology for another six months and then being transferred over. So that's probably the best result I could get just to have a chat with them and uh, see what's next. Yeah. So I'm not expecting a, a scan yet because they normally do say uh, 0.4 is the uh, is the limit where they would scan in Norfolk. Um, at least I can have a chat with them, see, and I'll ask them. I will ask them for a scan, and they'll probably say no. I'm just going to take you over to this patonk. 
a tall little game here which locals and expats um, play so We're going for Tonk, don't really know what they're doing. It's not Patong, they're flown in discs. Don't really know what they're doing, to tell the truth. Uh, that's not the Patong, this is the Patong arena. Right, so we're nearly going to finish this. A, this is the local Patonk uh, place which people do have regular little tournaments there. And I think they're playing Patonk at the top there. So locals and expats, it gets competitive. Little mini golf down here. Good enough for children. Little hotel over here, looks fine. So we're now just going to come to the end of the video, to be honest. There's a little restaurant here called the Moccolino where we just walked back up to our hotel. Um, picture of the sea, calm today, so there's no wind, around the corner there, Palmar, and we've got to get the Gran Arona or Sol Arona, yep, so it is in the distance there, so the best hotel, most expensive hotel here in Cristianos, I know Alan homemade blogs go there quite a bit. So, uh, good reports about that, but then, you know, you get what you pay for. So yeah, very, very, very pleasant. The sun is breaking through, burning off the clouds. So this afternoon, be nice and warm. It's 25, 26. So it's more than, more than pleasant for early March. Beats the six, seven degrees in rain back in the UK. So, I'm just going to stand and just pan you around again to the harbour of Christianos. So, there we go. Fred Olsen boats and the Armas boats have gone, gone to La Gomera or somewhere. And uh, the regular trips every day over there. So, we're just going to walk you around. Two little restaurants here. I'll tell you, one called Moccolino, which is right in the corner here. Which um, no different to us. I think it's a tapas and cocktail bar. And um, yeah, so we're going to end the video. Thanks very much. We're going to do some more little walks every sort of every day. And. Uh, upload them so thanks very much for for watching thank you